so today I have another beauty haul for you so these are some of the items I purchased in the last two or, or three months so again I don't want to make it a long video so I will just go through it quickly and uh, all of these items I will review them soon on my blog so if you are more interested please check out my blog that is www.vivalahighstreet.com so first thing is Pantene Sh Aqua Pure Shampoo so recently I felt that my hair was feeling very heavy and I wanted some lightweight shampoo I bought it for $8 and I have just used it 4 or 5 times as you can see but I'm so 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 happy with this shampoo my hair feels so light and I can easily go without shampooing my hair for 3-4 days but earlier I used to feel, I feel my hair used to feel so heavy and I used to like shampoo every alternate day so if it is available wherever you are please do try and the next thing is Maybelline Pure Liquid Mineral Healthy Natural Foundation I'm not sure but I think $18 and I have it in shade number OC3 so and it's 25 ml a product so this was the um, uh, this was the darkest uh, color but it was still so light for me and uh, it has SPF 18 and but I really don't like the packaging so it's new and the plastic cap has already cracked so thumbs up for packaging so this was too light for me and I used to look like a ghost so I went and purchased Revlon Photo Ready in caramel 10 shade number 10 caramel and it is SPF 20 and it is again for $20 so now what I do is just mix this and this and I think I get my perfect color so but I haven't used it for a long time so I cannot tell you much about it but I will let you know soon and the next thing is uh, the body shop tea tree blemish gel so I have some points in my Daimaru card so I just went and bought this so the but the retail price is $9 so it is just a gel which you are supposed to apply on your pimples but I think it's a little unhygienic because we dab it on the pimples and then just put it back in the container and I I've just used it once or twice so I cannot really comment on it but I will let you know if my pimples dry up or I think some improvement in it okay. next thing is just a Shiseido eyebrow pencil which I picked up uh, from drugstore and it is the color gray and it was just for two dollars and the thing is Queen Helen mint julep mask so my friend ordered uh, this mask from the internet and she gave one to me as well I don't know the actual price but it helps dry up acne pimples rinse away blackheads and shrink and large pores and it is very green uh, minty type of mask and I've used it three or four times as you can see but I don't know if there is any improvement in my pores or my acne or pimples. The Kiss Me Heavy Rotation Eyeliner Pencil. So Kiss Me is a Japanese brand and this pencil is in number 01 Deep Black. So it is just a eyeliner pencil and but the best thing is that it has a sponge here so if you want to smudge your eyeliner you can do that it is something i mm, i really wanted so i saw this brand called too cool for school in korea and i saw these lipsticks but i thought they were expensive and i did not buy it but then when i came to japan i was like regretting i should have bought it and then i suddenly saw too cool for school like for a limited time shop in namba uh, namba marui so now I just had to pick it up so I bought this lipstick and it is just a nice nude color and uh, but this was expensive for 14 or 15 dollars but I just love this color and and the next thing is from this brand called Love, Love Shuka which is a very famous brand in Japan it is owned by Kanebo which is like a cosmetic giant 
and I bought this uh, eyeshadow from Love Shuka and it was for $8 which I think is very expensive for eyeshadow but the packaging sucks so it has already started peeling from here and the eyeshadow uh, has a great fall you see the packaging is already peeling from here so it's very bad and it's supposed to be a very high-end expensive brand but I don't know so this is the purple color so it is dark which is very unusual for Japanese brands which is very they are not very pigmented but this one is pretty pigmented the next thing is uh, this Etude House Sun Prize uh, cooling body spray with 50 plus SPF so I saw this Spray and I thought it was so cute. I'm always lazy to apply sunscreen So this is just a spray which you could just spray on your face and also on your whole body Which I think is a very good thing and it is ideal for lazy people like me and also I got this Sunprise all cleanser free so this is an uh, facial foam cleanser and it is good for removing sun creams and uh, UV applications so I generally use it at night because so that it can remove my sunscreen and my other makeup which has SPF in it and the next thing is crazy uh, tightening facial mask so there are like four facial masks in it for five dollars and I've seen a lot of bloggers using it and so I just picked it a four face mask because I generally don't know if it works or for me or not if I just have one mask so now if I have for four masks I can use it like one every week and, and, and I can actually feel some difference in my skin so I think that is everything I have so if you like my haul please give me a thumbs up and also subscribe to my channel also for full reviews of all the items that I shown to you just now please visit my blog that is www.vivalahighstreet.com that's it for my video thanks for watching bye bye <laughs>